Hey guys, Nog Rules here, and I'm coming at you with another pickups video. Now, this one's a pretty big one, so like normally, I'm, I'm not going to spend too much time on every game, but I want to kind of start with the more gaming related items because I, I always like to see the more weird stuff that people pick up, not just the games, but gaming related stuff. So, first thing is this uh, Super Mario candy dispenser thing. It looks pretty badass. Probably never eat the candy because it's probably not any good, but that's pretty cool. I like finding that, so. Um, let's see here. This thing, I was really super excited. I found a Nintendo World Championships t-shirt. How awesome is that? Now, it's from 2002, and I was talking to the guys on Nintendo Age, and they said that it was from Hot Topic, maybe? But it's a kid's size, so I'm probably just going to get like a little frame for it to so hang it up in the man den, so that is awesome. I was really excited to find that. I don't know, I just thought, hey, maybe I'll check out the kids' shirts for some reason. I don't know, I was drawn to it, and that's what I found, so. Uh, that was really awesome. Uh, another kind of cool thing that I came across were these two books here. They're from the Phoenix Wright series, and they're, they're manga novels, which are really cool, and there's volume one volume two so I'll let you get in there but it's kind of cool um Capcom made it so I thought cool I've never actually played the Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney before but uh, I might put those up for trade or maybe sell them I don't know but I couldn't leave them there they look too cool so that's that um, I picked up my wife Super Mario Land 3D just because it's badass. It was on sale for like 15 bucks at Costco, so I couldn't pass it up. Um, I got a hold of a dude, and like I said before, I'm beefing up my uh, GameCube collection. I'm gonna try to go for a full collection, but um, I got a hold of a boxed platinum GameCube. Um, it's got most of the paperwork. I don't know exactly all the paperwork that's inside, but the box is in pretty good shape. Um, I have it out right now, but that is badass. But the thing that I was really stoked about was it came with the sleeve for the Game Boy Player um, disc, which is awesome. I'll just grab mine right here. Uh, my disc doesn't have it, so if we crack this open. This is pretty awesome. I don't know. There we go. It's so flattened. There we go. And then we can slip this right in there. And bam, we got the sleeve. So that is awesome. I was really excited to find that in the box. Uh, I got a TurboGrafx-16 game. Finally, so I can test uh, some mods that I've been doing for Staven Born on the TurboGrafx-16. So the game is Ballistics. So that was cool. TurboGrafx-16 stuff is not too common. Um, I went to a new thrift store and they had a few PlayStation titles, but I found this, which is Fatal Fury Collection. It's got 1, 2, Fatal Fury Special, and Fatal Fury 3 for the PlayStation 2. Uh, that's pretty awesome. I, I don't collect too much for PlayStation 2, but it's complete. It's in great condition. So, but I like fighting games though, so I'll have to check that out. And now I scored a whole ton of GameCube games again. So I'll just go over them super quick here. Uh, I got Enter the Matrix, just disc one only. Um, I already have that game, so I will probably send that out to anybody who needs it. Um, let's see here. Most of these are complete again. So I got Medal of Honor Frontline, uh, NHL 2003, uh, Splinter Cell, the first one, Prince of Persia Warrior Within, Rainbow Six Three, uh, this one I was pretty excited about. It's complete. 
It's Star Fox Adventures. So that's super cool. We got Sonic uh, Adventure, the director's cut. Uh, one that I was really, really super pumped about was Sonic Adventure Battle 2. This game is super fun. Uh, you can hook up your Game Boy Advance and stuff to it. Really super cool game if you haven't played that. I got uh, Metroid Prime. Uh, Killer 7. Uh, which is a really weird game. It's kind of cell shaded. I remember playing it a long time ago. That's a pretty weird ass game. We got uh, Freestyle Street Soccer. Uh, MLB Slugfest 2003. And I only paid about a buck fifty a game, so it was that's why there's a few sports titles. But Madden 07 and Madden 2005. But Overall, I think there's some good titles like the Sonic Adventure Battle 2, Star Fox, Metroid, Prince of Persia, stuff like that. So, that is my pickups. Let me know what you guys think. Um, I was really pumped to get, you know, all these games and basically paid nothing. I was going to say I stole them, but a buck fifty a game is pretty much stealing. So, let me know what you think and I'll talk to you guys soon.